There have been two fires in the past two days in high-rise buildings in New York and Chicago. Both have underlined the possibilities for tragedy in a modern skyscraper fire. We have a report from ABC's Ann Medina. A fire broke out last night in the World Trade Center, the second tallest building complex in the world. No one died. The building was unoccupied. The fire began in an electrical wiring closet on the 11th floor. There should have been fire stops to prevent it from spreading, but there weren't. The fire spread to six other floors. potato chips now, or if you wait 10 minutes, you can have all the brains you can eat. It has dropped 50 millibars in 10 hours. Um, I apologize. This is just horrific. Sometime on August 16th, roughly a year from now, there's a chance that we might have impact. The impact of the larger comet will be nothing less than an extinction-level event. It will strike land in western Canada, three hours after Biedemann. Within a week, the skies will be dark with dust from the impact, and they will stay dark for two years. I'm so glad you're going to meet my friends, Johnny. Are they going to be my friends, too? You bet. What's the name of the place we're going? Canada. And don't be afraid. There's another way for us to get there. Where? To Greenland. There are pilots going from up in Canada. And they're taking people that are not military. Look, it's just over 12 hours to all is good. Hey, Prince Harry. Remember when you told us to bring it at the Invictus Games? Careful what you wish for. Boom. Oh, really? Please. Boom.